What's up, everyone? I'm Hans Gonzo. Most people might know me from my Twitter post and being a little silly on the internet, but uh, maybe you'd be surprised to hear that at one point in my life, well, several points, I was the number one KOF player in the world. As a result, I was given the opportunity to play KOF 15 early, and I've playing, been playing around a lot with a lot of the system mechanics. As a result, I was given the opportunity to play KOF 15 early, and I've been playing around with a lot of the system mechanics and characters. I just wanted to break down the 10 most substantial differences between past KOFs and this one. Let's get started. Number one, they got rid of Leona's instant overhead cancel from her jumping A attack. You actually can't cancel it from into anything. So just to illustrate, this is her super attack, and she used to be able to do an instant overhead into it, and now you can't even cancel it into anything. You can't cancel jumping A at all. It's a lot harder to do, but it's still possible, like that. It is a pretty substantial nerf in regards to Leona's gameplay. They did give her some other options, but it is another difference. Okay, for number two, we're gonna be talking about Elizabeth. Elizabeth has a lot of changes from her KOF 13 counterpart, uh, but before I illustrate that, I just need to take a quick sip of water, and then we'll get right back on with the video. Yeah. 